Hello, hello, how are you doing? Welcome to Fedester's YouTube channel. Today we are going to do some international cha-cha-cha. There are multiple types of cha-cha-cha. There are the authentic the Cuban style, and then the American style, and then the international style. Right, but today we are going to do some international. But you can do it in single style because very similar, right? Basic is basic. We're going to do some basic and then we will put some advanced stuff from Pachanga, for example. We have some isolation in it and then we'll see how it will go. Now, let's talk about the basic first and then we can put together all the elements, right? So, the basic element first, the Absolute basic, drop step and the running side. So, first we step backward in our right. Step back, only once, middle, right. Then we place your weight to the left. Okay, this is the drop step. So, back and forward. Okay. Back and forward. Is it? Rocking step. So, we have a rock. Step and after that we will do a long step. If it's American step or Cuban, you can do it with running. So these are the differences. So long step, forward, cross behind, and step one more time forward with the right. One step the long step. So we step forward with the right, cross behind with the left, and step forward with the right again. From the side. You can see when we are crossing, we close our tight from the front. We close our tight. Okay? Close the knee, close the tight. And that's more international. From the side, you can see international, straight legs, and precise low steps. The American is more bent knee. And the Cuban style, just running and just for fun, okay? But we would like to challenge you, so now let's do it with straight legs. To make it straight, we need to have a tension in our body. First, we need a straight spine. Straighten it and keep your balance. And then you need to do the rotation, right? Release the hip one side and stand one foot. And that's how we can start. Step back. Two, three, drop step, four, and one. Now we do a forward roll. Drop step, replace the weight. And then drop step back. Left. Pachanga. 
So what is pachanga? Pachanga is a is a, uh, is a Latin dance style, small footwork, but they use it in salsa, bachata, and cha 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 as well. So basically, the, one of the basic steps is when you tap the side, and the sister is much looser, uh, looser, mm -hmm. loose, <laughs> yes, much more soft. <laughs> That's what I meant to say, um, and it's more by the elevation. You see, it's. It's not really for competition, right? That's really for performance. So how we do it, we keep the same structure and then we just point to the side, close, change the weight, catch the side. One and two and one and two. Okay? From the side. You can see inside how I change the weight. Straight leg. Bring it in. Change it. Change it and then set the side. But you see that I'm barely using the same isolated movement. Yes? I keep my body straight. Okay? Now, this is three elements we put together. And of course, we put some else in it, but this is the base. Okay? Let's get started. First, we do the basic. But if we do a turn, then we do the forward stroke. And it's not it rocking back. Two, three, cha, cha, one. Now we step over, but we turn to the right. Turn to the right. Two, three. And the long step. Cha, cha, one. There's one more time because it's a tricky one. When we go forward and we do a sport turn, after the lock step, we have a little curve. And two, three, four, and one. Forward two, turn, backward three, you see? And I'm not stepping backward, but I go to the back. And now the lock step. Side, cross, back. I curve the same long step. Okay, one step. Two, three, four, and one. Two, three, four, and one. One more time, you can practice this. As many times you want. Two, three, four, and one. Okay? Now, we can do it only once. And then we do a rock step again. Two, three, I'm going to close the foot. Four. Okay, we won't move anywhere. Make sure you practice first the first step with the turn. You can see clearly everything in the video. We step forward with the left, half turn, forward with the right, turn and lock step. And you can repeat this as many times you need, and then you can move to the second step. It's a video, so you can replay it as much. One. Now, after what we do is rock step. Yes, two, three, four, and one. Now let's see from the hand. From the side. If I go back with the right, two, repeat my weight, three, then close on four. Question. This would be the four. Or this would be the four. Which one? Tip. Now the answer is the second. Because this is not a step. I step back, forward, I'm on the left. If I want a four and a step, I need to close. It's not enough. I put my weight on it. Okay? And again. And one. So it you will step on the right two times in a closed position. Two, three, four, and one. Okay? Let's repeat a couple of times with my trust. Two, three, four, and one. You see, it's very quick. You close and switch the way. And two, three, four, and one. 
play camp for the knees. Okay, so it's not just marching like a baby. Do you know who need to go to the restroom? No? Really? Make good attention in your leg and show the knee. Show me the knee. Where is your weight? Of course, when it's bent, it's not there, it's on other weight. Okay? Let's put together. Face it. With a turn, go step backward, while we are turning, and then it's close, shut and jump. Five, six, seven, eight, and roll. Step, chop, 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 roll. Step and chop, 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 roll. Step and chop, chop, chop. You see, if we come to like this, rock, step, chop, chop, you see that we don't skip anything. Let's do one more time, but now with numbers. Number goes, and, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one. All right, now, we go to the Pachanga. Pachanga goes to the last, because we finish Four and one on the right. So we do the pattern, yeah? Two and three. Yes, it's fast. Not two, three, four. It's two and three. Okay? Tap and tap. Three, four, one, two and three. Yes? One, two, and three. Again, it's in this round because you close and speed the way. Only, only. And. Two. And. One time the rock step. Two turn place. And. Two. Three. Four. And. One. Two. And three. Four. And one. After that, of course, we're going to have a little fun part. With a hit. Let's see how it goes. Two and three, we are standing on the left and we are going to go with the right. But it's too early because we need the four and one to make another move. So, what we'll do is two hit bump to the right. Four and one and. You see, it's and, four and. One and this is not by the for no, no. I stay here in the middle and I'm using the pendulum action in the hip. I'm using my hip in pendulum. Okay? Two foot, two foot, two. Four and one and pull the weight on the left. Okay, let's come from the basic press. And two, three, four and one. Two and three, four and one, two and three and four and one. And then we go for the last step, which is the Cuban break. We already practiced the Cuban break, right? We just need to put it into the curve. So we have the feet to bump to the right. Four and one and Cuban break starting to the right. Two and three. And four and one, two and three and four and one. Finishing on the left. What we can do from here? Starting from the very beginning. Two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, four and one, two and three, four and one and two and. Three. And four and one, two and three and four and one, two, three. Yes? All right. Now, if you practice enough and if you feel that you are ready to do it to the music, then here we go. Yeah. 
for today. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you practice and when you practice enough then record it and send us the share the story and tag us. Okay? So follow us, uh, subscribe, like it, everything what is possible and we are waiting for dancing with you in any of the studios or in Fort Worth or in Carlinville. My name is Sebastian and thank you for joining our Dancing Bye-bye.